All right, you had your turkey yesterday. Now the shopaholics are working off that extra food at stores all across the metro. Beth Vaughn is live at the Legends in Kansas City, Kansas. Uh, Beth, are you finding yourself any goodness? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to keep my wallet in my purse here this morning, unfortunately. But as the sun is rising here this morning, we're seeing more and more folks coming out here to the Legends. You know, traffic actually starting to pick up in the parking lot, uh, looking fuller uh, than ever this morning. However, last night was when the real madness began about 10 o'clock. They opened up their doors for what was called Midnight Magic. And, uh, you know, many of these stores were offering sales up to 60% off last night. So really, they started even uh, a day earlier. Now, Banana Group, Banana Banana Republic told us they had about 120 people lined up by about 10:30 last night, and according to their district manager, that was bigger than last year, which is really what economists and retail experts had been hoping for. Many use Black Friday as a gauge for the holiday shopping season. Now we are told that crowds will pick up here at again uh, in just about an hour, you know, to those full holiday madness crowds, all of the lines. Uh, but we did just speak with uh, two foreign exchange students who are experiencing seeing their first Black Friday and first Thanksgiving here in the U.S. Take a listen. Yeah, it's typical American, I think, yeah. Of course, there's a lot of commercials and advertisement in Europe, too, but um, I think it's more here in the U.S. Back home, you know, if, if you compare the normal price, like the regular price here, and back home, it's cheap already. And now it's even more cheap. So it's like, wow, we, we couldn't decide anything. <laughs> Reacting to the, all of those low prices there, Kristen, we think we know deals. You know, wait until you come from Sweden is what he says. So, of course, again, like I said, uh, the crowd should pick up here in about an hour. So if you're looking to do your shopping with no lines, now is the time. For now, we're live in Kansas City, Kansas. Beth Vaughn, NBC Action News. All right. Thanks, Beth.